Hello YouTube and welcome to this tutorial. Uh, so I'm just going to give you the lowdown on this new tool for Adobe After Effects CS4 and it's called the Panini tool. So with the Panini tool, it's first, it, uh, it has quite a few things, I just want to show you that. So, so you want to go to Composition, New Composition and then you want to set it to uh, 1280 by 720 and make it about a minute 25 frames a second and ok so we've got our composition and now what we want to do is you want to click on our panini tool like so and once we're with our panini tool what we need to do is wherever we click you can see a panini so this is one of the basics of the panini tool and one of the few things which you can do with it, uh, you can have Panini text. So if you click on this text tool and type in a few things, and it comes out as Panini. It's great, isn't it? So now we've checked out the Panini tool. Let's click on um, click on it again. Okay. So. Uh, you can change some of the colours with the panini tool, so it'd be clicker. Just click and make another panini. And we go on uh, layer, new, solid. Make it black. And actually, yeah, let's put another panini on top of that. So, just put the panini on top. There you go. And then if you go on effect, colour correction, and then. CC tone. As you can see, it's been changed to these three colours. So what we want to do now is just change it. So let's give it a bluey colour. And there we go. So this is the basics of the Panini tool. This is Monkey King 44, signing out. <laughs>